welcome to another session of GIS Network. Today let us see some tips for table in Word. So this table you have created and it is having three columns, name English Malayalam and it is having some data also. Okay. And you forgot to put the serial numbers. Now we are going to put the serial number. What you will do? You will insert a column to the left. Okay. And we give the heading as serial number. Since only four, in this case only four are there means what you will do? One, two, you will give like that. But automatically if you are having many rows simplest way is just select the rows and give bullets that's all okay see now you are going to insert one more row you know for inserting row what you will do at the end of the last data give tab see it is going on creating okay now if you, if you are removing one row select the row delete cell enter row see the serial number is 3 okay so it has been arranged okay so this is how easily we can insert serial numbers in the table in ms word if you are manually giving 1 2 3 4 means and you are deleting a row this automatic updation will not happen. Since you have used the numbering using the bullet system, uh, sorry, the number system, that will be automatically updated. Very simple, right? And now, you wish to insert a table in your word screen. So, what is the normal procedure you do? You go to insert and then you go to table and select the number of rows or column okay I'll show you one more way that is give plus minus 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 so again plus and give plus minus 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 plus minus 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 plus okay at the last plus you enter key see automatically it has created a table tab okay. very simple and this minus will give it specifies the length of the cell it's plus and you are giving minus minus and again plus minus minus so plus and I'm giving I need a big cell enter okay. okay so this is a simplest way for creating table in word normally what you'll do if when you go to insert you'll get the same size cells right so we have to go there, we have to reduce the size and all. Now based on the width of the cell, you can create the table using plus and minus. Very simple. So all of you try this technique while using word for creating table. And suppose, see this, you are going to find the total of this, 43 plus 43 plus 37. Or I will I'll insert one more column and the heading is total. Okay, so 23 plus 43, 34 plus 43, 34 plus 37, you need like that. Okay. So what you will do, you go to layout, 
formula. That is, be in the cell where you need the answer. Go to layout, formula, say to that, sum of left. Okay. See, 23 plus 43, 66. Same thing you need for these two rows. Just copy it. Copy and paste it. So this is also 66. This is also 66. Now what you need? You need to change the answer. Right. So select it. Right click. Update field. See it has updated. 34 plus 43 is 77. And here also update. See 34 plus 37 is 71. Now for getting the total of this layout formula sum of above. Okay. So if you need average of this layout formula by default is sum. Okay. So just give your function average. So average of above. Okay. So this is how automatically you can number the data in a table and you can create a table based on your necessity. You can create the breadth of the table and how to find total and we, are, we copied the total and we updated it according to the values. Very simple. All of you try this. Thank you.